New Hampshire hospitals and nursing homes are in a job market crunch. They're having trouble hiring nurses because the state's criminal records check process takes too long. House Bill 637 was intended to fix that. The bill is a much needed bill to allow institutions, nursing homes, hospitals, to do essentially instantaneous background checks through a secure portal to a, a database that will be built. But Thursday night, Democrats amended the bill to restrict open online access to this criminal conviction registry. I think the unintended consequences are that um, it may increase harassment of people um, based on maybe inaccurate information. Republicans say Democrats are putting up unnecessary barriers to information that is already public in the court system. What the Democrats have done by passing this amendment is to protect criminals from exposure to people who want to know what their next door neighbor who moved in has done, whether their babysitter has committed a crime in, the, in somewhere else before they moved here. Senate Republicans are also raising concerns that the amended bill will apply to more than just the newly created online criminal records database and potentially restrict public access to the existing sex offender registry. In a statement to News 9, the Department of Safety sounded a note of caution, saying, quote, the department has concerns regarding the amendment and is examining how it changes the nature of the bill. We're currently in the process of determining the impact. It was never my intention, nor do I believe this amendment changes the sex offender registry at all. In Concord, Adam Saxton, WMUR News 9.